In this video, I'm going to teach you how to connect ATEM Mini Pro ISO to computer. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. In this video, I'm going to give you easy to follow instructions on how to properly set up and use your ATEM Mini Pro ISO. You will be able to connect it to various different devices and of course, use it within your computer, laptop and so on. So, all that you have to do to set it up is to make sure that it has sufficient power. Make sure that the power cable is properly connected and inserted fully. Now, there are various different purposes for connecting your ATEM Mini to a computer. The most common purpose is going to be with a USB connection to use it as a webcam. So, as you can see, I have various different examples here. And like I mentioned, usually the one that most people will seek is USB. So, all that you have to do is plug one end over here into this ATEM Mini Pro and another one into your computer with a USB cable. This allows you to use your ATEM Mini Pro ISO as a webcam source for various applications like streaming software, video conferencing, or recording software. So all that you have to do is use the included USB cable to connect the ATEM Mini Pro ISO to your computer's USB port. You can also use it for streaming and various other functionalities. You can use it with HDMI, so as you can see, this is the secondary example that I chose. And once again, it is as simple as connecting one end of the HDMI cable into the ATEM Mini Pro and another one into your computer. Just plug them into the appropriate ports and you will be able to get them to work. Primarily, HDMI is going to be used for monitoring or recording. So you can connect the ATEM Mini Pro ISO's HDMI output to your computer's HDMI input for monitoring the video feed or recording it using capture cards. And once again, it is as simple as using the proper cable. As long as you connect one end of the cable into the ATEM and another one into your computer, it will be detected as a source for various different things. I hope I was able to help you on how to connect a 10 Mini Pro ISO to a computer. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.